My name is Thierry Marchandise, and today I'd like to show you what Axway Amplify Enterprise Marketplace could look like for your company as your digital store for your API products. We'll see first the consumer experience of subscribing to a product that is packaging several APIs for a business use case. This is the home page. We have easily branded it for Amplify Insurance with our logo, our tagline, our colors, our font, and our graphical elements. We have featured some product categories, and the consumer can see car insurance resale product as the most recent product we've published. It's easy to search in this product catalog by entering keywords or selecting one of the categories. They can see the product overview and learn more about it with the featured documentation that should convince them they can benefit from this product. They can also see the list of packaged APIs and have a look to their specifications. Once they have enough information, they can decide to subscribe to the product. They have just to click on subscribe or select a plan in the plans tab. As our car dealer plan requires an approval, they need to wait to receive the confirmation once the product manager has approved the request. This can be very quick. We'll see how it is behind the scene for the product manager to build and monetize a product composed of several APIs coming from various environments. In the service registry, I can see that absolutely all APIs of my company are automatically collected from all our APIs gateways environments. These are REST APIs with OpenAPI specification 2 or 3 as well as other types of API. No matter how many different API gateways we have, Amazon, APG, Axway, Azure, Microsoft, and others, the API platform team has connected all these environments to our Amplify platform so we can see here new services and updates automatically. I'll start by creating the product profile with a simple name and a short description that are key for consumers to understand clearly what is this product about. I also add a nice icon that will make the product easy to identify. Next, this is where I combine several assets among the ones we have seen previously in my new product. I select Quote and Subscription API, Cars API, and Customer API, which are the three necessary assets that my consumer will need to resell car insurance via an API integration with us. Next, we need to define a usage plan. There are free and paid plans, so it's a good time to ask ourselves what is the monetization strategy for our new product. If it's direct monetization, I will choose a paid plan and define a price per quota of transaction, for instance. Next, I need to add documentation to my product. I can, for instance, give information about how I get started and what is needed to create a new instant quote. It's important to take time to document your product on business value, technical adoption and support. And finally, we see how this product manager can monitor the adoption and the success of the API products. Thanks to Amplify platform, we can monitor API health, usage and traffic across all our APIs wherever they are exposed from. We can compare traffic of current week or day versus the previous. This lets us identify behavior changes. As an API product manager, I can also see subscription usage metrics on the past months. This helps me to understand key consumer engagement and make informed investment decisions. So that was an example of what you can expect from Amplify Enterprise Marketplace as your own digital store for your API products. Just click on the provided link to learn more about it. Thanks for watching.